<clears throat> Good morning. Um, I know it's been a while since I made my last video and been kind of busy, crazy, you know, just uh, getting ready for the upcoming winter, believe it or not. Doing a lot of working on uh, getting wood ready and stuff like that, but uh, several topics that I'll be going over, um, not today per se, but uh, I got a couple of things that I wanted to discuss. Um, but uh, what I wanted to focus on today was uh, this disaster in the Gulf with the BP oil spill and uh, how it's decimating the coast all through the Panhandle, through Florida, through uh, Louisiana, you know, it's just uh, Alabama, it, 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 it's crazy. It's uh, absolutely amazing to me. And, uh, you know, all these poor people are losing their jobs because w when you fish for a living, and the oil's killing everything in there, and it's what are we on day 48 or 49 now? And it's like it's you know just continues to gush out, and they're still tr spinning their wheels trying to figure out what they're going to do. It's just ludicrous to me, and uh, it's a very very sad situation, and uh, it's actually quite disgusting. Not surprising that the government, you know, our esteemed President Obama, and I say that. Uh, <laughs> I just, uh, you know, until uh, James Carvel, the raging Cajun, flipped out, who's a Democrat himself, Obama was spending most of his time doing fundraisers and playing basketball and golf, which is fantastic, instead of addressing the issue. And then, of course, after that, then he got on TV and said how he was right on top of this event and, uh, you know, taking care of things. And he, he, what's he doing? What's, you know? What are we doing? Let's get going. Let's do something to help these poor people down there. Let's get this cleaned up. I mean, it's just polluting the ocean. You know, when you're talking about a half a million to uh, 800,000 gallons of oil a day being dumped into the ocean, it, it just, it's, it's staggering. It really is just amazing to me. So, um, just kind of wanted to address that and uh, just, uh, you know, just it's another nail in the coffin, if you will. I mean, it's just, you know, we're destroying this planet little by little, and it's uh, nobody seems to care. It's just, it's just it's unbelievable to me. You know, uh, I'm telling you, my friends out there that are listening, uh, we need to take care of our business. You need to prepare. You need to be ready because I just, I, you know, I've been calling this for about two years now. I see very, very bad things coming down the line, and uh, the economy's not getting any better. You know, there's no jobs being created in. Eventually, they're going to raise our taxes because they have no other option, you know. And uh, I mean, I'm telling you what, I'm taxed to the max myself right now, and I'm disgusted with it. I'm sick of paying taxes for everything, and they raise taxes on everything. And uh, you know, I've, I've I've had it, and I'm sure a lot of other people have had it. So uh, you know, I it it'll take just a small spark to set things off, and uh, you know, I, I see a lot of anger in the country. You know, um, it's just. It's very sad, very, very sad what's going on, and I hate to see it, and, uh, you know, I just, uh, I hope I have enough time to protect my family and keep them safe. I'm working on it, and I hope you people are as well. I really, really do, because I'll tell you what, when things go bad, they're going to go bad in a hurry. And uh, remember what happened down in Louisiana when uh, the hurricane happened down there. Everybody was civil for two days, helping each other and doing the right thing. Well, on the third day, anarchy took over. Because when the government didn't come in immediately and give people food and water and take care of things, they had to take care of themselves. And it was a while before the government got down there. And what did the government do when they got down there? Well, they took the guns away from the people. You know, I mean, it's just, it's, it's crazy. This is America, you know. I mean, we're supposed to take care of ourselves. But that's my little rant for today. Um, I'm going to be doing some other videos coming up just to talk about some different things. And... Uh, you know, just what's going on, and uh, I hope things are going well with everybody. I hope you're preparing. Get yourself ready. Protect your family. If you do nothing else, nothing else, but put aside two weeks' worth of food and water, that's something, okay? That gives you a heads up on most people. Um, but there's a lot more to be done. So uh, good luck to you all, and uh, I will talk to you soon. Thank you.